Hello, hello, lovely sim racers. I'm Konstantinos, and this is a special edition of Lovely Sim Racing. We are in the Nordschleife. 24-hour race. We're eight hours to go, and the rest of the team has been doing an amazing job with, uh, uh, well, taking us. So, we started off P41, T1, actually turn one of lap one at the start of the race someone plowed through the field and sent us all the way to the end and slowly we've been climbing and now we are in p35 daniel is in the car now from our lovely community he suffered a puncture um, just moments ago on a previous lap and he had to pit uh, p35 is still ours and we're going strong just started to rain so i have been practicing a lot on the Nords, I am not good. Like, my lap times are nowhere compared to my teammates. But the point of a 24-hour race is to, you know, see it through. Um, so, uh, the idea is that I will jump in the car and go as, as steady as I can. Avoid the walls. Uh, avoid any confrontations. And just bring it uh, over to... I think Daniel will be, ta will be taking it off of me. So, I'll be jumping in the car right after Daniel's stint. I'll take it for one stint out. It'll be my first stint in a race in the Nordschleife. So it will be quite a handful for me. It just started raining. And um, the idea is that I won't take it in the rain. Maybe a damp track. I don't get killed or something. Um, but essentially, that's the idea. So, um, yeah. That's the plan for now. Let's... Uh, Let's see how Dan is doing here. I also let me let me make some changes to the actually not to the stream. I want to put in the. I want to add my um, co-drivers as an overlay, which I hadn't done. It is extremely early. I got up at 5.30. It's been up for two hours now. Did some practice. It is... It is a handful. I'm really excited, though. To be honest. Let's put in some text.
should have done this earlier. <laughs> Much earlier. Just put it like that. That yeah, looks pretty cool. this actually we can go just watching that unfold let's also open discord and see how daniel's doing hey daniel how you doing man uh you're live on stream now um how's the wet thank you slippery it is huh i'm terrified <laughs> just just to the idea I couldn't sleep last night. Honestly, I was so excited. The <laughs> whole thing. It's like it's uh, it's that mixture. Well, actually, I always like putting myself in um you know, outside of my comfort zone every every time. So, um this isn't uh, anything different. I could have been sleeping right now on a Sunday morning. This is much more interesting. You know, for me, you and a handful of other people. Yes. But if I tell this to my friends, they'd be like, "Why aren't you sleeping?" <laughs> and then they'll go into the uh, the whole, but playing a game, and then I try to you know explain that this is not a game. <laughs> I always lose. I just don't explain it. Mm. I'm on the computer. That's enough for them to know. I'm working. It's a damn sight easy now I can see where I'm going. At daytime. Yep. And it's still 7.30, so I still have to be really quiet at home. Everyone's still asleep. Oh, wow, we have Formula One starting in about 20 minutes. Forgot about that. Imagine. I am. After this stint, I think I'm going to sleep. Who's picking up after me? Uh, I think Mr. Git should be back soon, and Scotty. All right. Um, the stint is eight laps maximum, so you do eight laps and go in, hit, and then yeah, go we're out, not right? we're not been doing that though, because the weather's been changing like this, like every twenty minutes or so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but that's the maximum stint in a good case. Yeah.
Hey, Jeff, welcome to the stream. You're late. You're drunk up late. Okay. Are you gonna... Oh, <laughs> shit, yeah. You, you've got 20 minutes, Jeff, to, uh, to, uh, to Suzuka. Sober up. <laughs> well, don't watch this while you're drunk. Well, watching Suzuka while you're drunk may be fun. I don't know. Keep me up to date, Jeff. If if you can. Red Bull 1-2. The which way around? Red Bull 1-2, yeah. Um, Yeah, who knows what's going to happen. I, I'm in... As a random fact, who knows what's going to happen if... They get into DNF Red Bull. Otherwise, we know what's going to happen. <laughs> it's the only reason for not for them not to win. Is uh, is Norris third? I think so. so yeah, five. Lando's third. I think yeah. Ferraris didn't go really well. They didn't. No, no. That is surprising. Is Science still in front of the clerk? I don't remember to be honest. I can look it up. I saw qualifying, but uh, as I already said, my memory isn't the best. So I remember 1-2, and that's pretty much it. So, results for qualifying. Verstappen, Perez, Norris signed the head of Leclerc. But then was P5 was Alonso, Piastri, Hamilton, and Leclerc was 8. What happened? So low. Oh, no. Oh my god, Hamilton ahead of Leclerc? I mean, we know Norris, like McLaren and Ferrari will be fighting each other tightly. But Hamilton ahead of Leclerc? Did not expect that. And not Hamilton per se, it's Mercedes. <laughs> Must have screwed it up a lot. Oh shit, he was P8, gap to Hamilton was like. 20 hundreds. Wow. Uh, yeah. That was close. Hello? Uh, Jeff, uh, I, I do know Matt and Tommy, the P1 channel, um, but I don't think I've ever watched any of their shows, like, when they do some, like, specials or reviews or something, I, I, I watch them, but not a watch-along or anything, though. He is a Leclerc fan, okay. Just a little bit. Thirty minutes, they say. Cloudy weather. Okay. Yeah. The track's been taken uh, two or three laps to dry out, mm -hmm. to the point where you can run in slicks. Um, we'll keep an eye on it.
You'll have to remind me of the whole process of swap, driver swap. So all I'll do is I'll um, I'll come to a stop in the pit box, do the pit stop, and then at the end of the countdown, it hands over to you really. So all you need to do is start the engine and go. All right. I'll leave I'll leave the ignition on and first gear. If I hit drive, I, I basically drive along with you, right? Yeah. It's better like that. No idea what happened there. Whitehead is behind you. <clears throat> Going yeah, strong someone, solo. I think someone just joined the server. So I had a great big massive lag spike going. Going down that hill. Let's get on the brakes. P20 to 12, that was a massive stint. Well, congrats. Can't sleep. Yeah, I just woke up. Whitehead ahead of us that just, just overtook us. He's doing the 24-hour race solo. I have no idea how he's doing it. Honestly, I don't know. And he's going in P3 right now. What the hell? How? How? Is, is it possible to do a 24-hour race on your own? Like, when does driver fatigue he can when do you say I cannot take it anymore Whitehead's going P3 and strong I don't believe it man <laughs> he must have someone at his house is he streaming I don't I haven't found anything now so I don't know I wasn't looking to be honest but like my entire YouTube feed is uh, 24 hour Nords, so I didn't see anything from him. Um, yeah, Jeff, it's a, it's a 10 minutes to 8 in the morning here. Been up since 5.30. Joined Daniel around 6.30, my time, I think. About an hour ago, just over an hour. Did some practice laps. Not very happy, but it is what it is. I'll be just super careful when I take the steering wheel. Yeah, it's very slippery. Yep.
No, Jeff, um, uh, rain is, uh, there are dry spots, there are puddles, there are everything. Rain can also start on part of a track, it's not a one thing, it just starts raining, it's everywhere. It's pretty much like the real thing. Relax the hands, massage, and everything. That is good to hear. Dash and Pitwall work perfectly. Oh, well, thank God. I mean, I found a few bugs. I'm trying to fix them. The the only issue I have with the um uh, with the dashboard is the class opponents are not working as they should, and the relatives on the track opponents also. I've seen them behave very weird. So I, those th those two things I need to investigate. Other than that, hopefully, everything's working fine. I need to put some time in the pit wall. That's the thing. That's my name. That's my next big thing. Now. I need to put more time in the pit wall. Jeff, I mean, you, you never not find new bugs. I constantly find stuff. Like, even now, I was out you know, running a practice session before I joined the server, and I was looking at the dashboard, and like, oh, I have to fix that. No, 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 no. So I, I promised myself I wouldn't do anything now. It's just a race. This stream will be live until the end of the race. I will be driving after Daniel. I'll take it for one stint, and then Mr. Git will probably take it after that. But I will be driving some more. This is my first ever 24-hour race. Um, actually, this is my second team race, to be honest. I, I've i limited... Well, yesterday I couldn't drive at all. Like, I was... I had... Um, I wasn't driving, but I went to a blood drive. I gave some blood. It's good for humanity, I guess. Um, so yesterday was a day I couldn't do anything. I couldn't um, uh, drive at all. I wasn't available. So my driving is limited to today and this morning, basically. Uh, we'll do one stint now, and yeah, maybe another stint later on or after Mr. Git. But I'll do probably do one more stint after this one. That'll do. But yeah, I'm not confident on this track, and much less on the um, the Bentley. For some reason, 
I just cannot, I cannot get a hand of this car. I jumped in the Ferrari, which I've been running for LFM Warrior Series. Immediately, I was at 835s. Immediately. When I say that, it's a big thing because with the Bentley, I'm at 846s, 848s. I cannot go anything lower than that. I jump in the Ferrari, and immediately I'm at 835. So that's like an improvement of 12, 13 seconds just by changing the car. And the Ferrari, I only did two laps. So, like, if I'm, I'm, I'm just, you know, um, assuming that if I actually did practice with a Ferrari, I'd be under the 830s. I'd be in a very good place. It's just a Bentley. I, I cannot drive it. I just cannot drive it. Yeah, it could be the setup, but this is a team race, so we're just going with the safest version of the setup. Everyone else is doing uh, 20s in the team. I can't. It's, like, honestly, it was the reason why I had a backup driver to replace me. Because um, I didn't feel I'm, I don't feel confident with this car. I just feel as if it's extremely understeery. It's not sharp in any place. Um, yeah, it can take the curbs fine, but it just doesn't feel right. And I had a driver from our community, uh, Christoph McFriedlich. He was ready to step in and take my place. Um, but eventually the team said it's not about, you know, winning or anything. It's, it's more about the teamwork and everything like that. So that kind of convinced me to actually participate in the race. It was always going to be a Mr. Git by Lovely. So it wasn't going to change. It's just that my participation was, I was not sure about it. I'm still, I'm still not sure about it, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, it, it, I know, but it's just that I can't get the car under me. I cannot get the car under me. Literally, it's like I'm... Can I look back? Um, it's literally, I just, I, I cannot, I cannot find the performance. And it's funny, because it's not like I can't do the track. Like, I know the track, I know how it works. Under braking and everything, the Ferrari, I'm just so much more confident. You turn in, the car will turn in. Of course, it, I'm also using setups, but both setups, and the Ferrari. Uh, I did the 835s, two laps, only two laps, just two laps. Immediately 835 with Coach Dave setup. Um, I didn't try the Ghost setups at all. Uh, with the Bentley, I'm using the setup here. I'm using Coach Dave setups. I've used everything. I just, I just, maybe it's, maybe it's the car. Completely, I just cannot get it to work for me. I don't know. Yeah, TC is uh, two, I think in this car you can crank it up it's not it's not about the power of the torque i just cannot get it to turn in it one thing that i have noticed and it's really annoying with the with the bentley is it doesn't break it cannot break you need to break a lot earlier uh, like i in t1 at the nurburgring i always break at the uh, the exit of the, the pick exit where it has that little um uh, arch the line it break, the line breaks for the pit exit. I always break hard there, and I make the turn. I absolutely make the turn with the apex and everything. With the Bentley, I have to break like 10 meters prior to that, and I still don't make the apex. It's just... Yeah. yeah, with the Porsche... Uh, the Porsche... So the thing is, like the Maka is, is, is an amazing car, very easy to, to drive, easy. It's very good to drive. Whereas the Porsche, even if you love the car, even if you enjoy the car, yeah, the car still wants to kill you. What's up, Daniel? More rain in 30 minutes. Really? Shit, I didn't yeah. see that. How the hell? Oh, man. Oh, shit. What are we gonna do? Mm. And carry on if you're not if you're not sure. Oh, I'm, I'm definitely I'm not even sure in the dry. <laughs> Don't think about that. <laughs> I mean, I'll carry on for now then. We'll wait till we get a proper dry spell, then you can hop in. Shit. Oh, 
I mean, you're tired, man. I can I can take the car. I can relieve you. I mean, honestly. That's okay. It's just that... Um, uh, 30 minutes rain. And it's going to be rain, rain. It's not going to be like a drizzle rain. Sound wise, I think the uh, I think the Aston is better. Although the the Bentley does have a grunt in itself, but I think the Aston is a bit more you know, sounds sounds much better. Not even the V12, the V8 sounds great. But you know, I'm it's it's I'm not even used to driving the Ferrari to be honest. Like I was driving, I've driven a lot of different cars. Like every you season, LFM. What times on the track is it, Mr. Gitt? And um, so Mr. Gitt, Mr. Gitt said he'll be available from 7 a.m. if need be. He's awake now, but he'll be available in about an hour. Okay. Uh, Oh, news update from Jeff. Wreck on lap one of Suzuka. What happened? Everyone okay? Who's out? Give us all the details, Jeff. Where's Tate? We're stopping out. Um, red flag. Oh, really? I can. I, let me let me pull it up on my mobile. Let me see. Red flag. Was it that serious? Ricardo is out. Okay. What the hell happened there? That's a tire barrier. Okay. Oh, wait. Ricardo is out. True. Who else? Is there anyone else? The two cars. Albon. Okay. Alban and Ricardo are, are out. Looks like Williams has Williams to deal. Cars crash this weekend. Yeah, it looks like Williams has to have. It's like it's like everyone, the, the universe wants Logan Sargent to drive sole for Williams, <laughs> and it's just not happening. They're probably gonna stop Logan Sargent. Put, put Alban in his car now. No, here's a start. Okay, so Verstappen broke free. And Norris all side by side with Sainz. What happened? Where? So Albon? No. Oh shit. Ricardo had Albon on his right hand side, didn't see him. Move to the right. Front left tire, rear right tire touched and spun. So they crashed in the snake. At the beginning, like uh, T3, T4, somewhere there. Oh dear. Yeah, those are those are high speed and very scary. Well, Ricardo didn't get a good start anyway. Spun a bit. Shit, that that was that was harsh. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a long red flag. The tire barriers are completely destroyed. Yeah, get those put back together. 
They have to put everything together, yeah. Uh -huh. I don't know how William's gonna pull through. So that's a lot of damage these guys are having. And this was pretty big too. <clears throat> Yeah, they had to, they, uh, it was Logan Sargent as well on Saturday, was it? Or on Friday? Yeah. But Sargent was using the wrecked chassis of Albon. So now, I don't think they're going to be able to use that chassis again. It's twice wrecked. Yeah, it's definitely a write-off now, that. Yeah. Damage to the track is pretty big. Not uncommon that as to do really. Yeah. Actually. Yeah. But they're really good at repairing. Like um, historically, they 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 fix things really fast there. Like every time there's a big a big crash or something, it doesn't take too long for them to uh, to wrap it up and uh, and just have everything in place. But this was pretty big. Like the entire tire barrier was completely taken out of position and destroyed. So yeah, it wasn't the tech tech pro that would have been easier to fix. To be honest. Yes, Jeff. Japanese are known for efficiency. Yes, they are. Oh, the Germans. Japanese. Oh, well, J yeah, of course. But Japanese are just more... Better at it. Um, they're, they're, they're different kind of efficiency, I'd say. Um, all right. Uh, Daniel Mr. Git says that he is being quiet. He's, he is watching the race. Um, he'll be on available seven onwards. If it weren't gonna rain, I I, I want to drive. I want to take the car, but I I don't mm -hmm. want to screw it up for everyone. Honestly, I, I'm just I don't have the confidence. Yeah, if you're not confident in the wet, then we'll just save your stint for a, a dry a dry spell. Um, with it being damp at the minute and uh, more rain on the way, then I'll probably just hand over to Mister Git really at the end of this stint. The game now is running at 86 FPS while watching you drive. I don't know if it makes if it's any different. Like if I'm just riding along with you, is it different when I'm driving? A little bit. No, no massive amount. No. Yeah. You can rely on it if you're setting your graphic settings up to just watch someone else. Because I'm currently at 85 FPS, but I have everything at low. I don't even have like contact shadows and stuff. Big grid and this track is heavy on the. How big is the grid? Unfortunately, is it 80, 80 teams racing on this it grid? It was at the start. How many are now? We're more like seventy now, I think. <laughs> what happened to the other, to the rest? <laughs> it was quite, didn't it? 
But I mean, why do you quit on a race like this if you can just jump, you know, teleport to the pits and fix the car? Like, wh why do you quit? I mean, this is this me, this really. isn't about winning. I mean, honestly, some I people is. Yeah, but you're taking part in a 24-hour race. If if you're only taking part to win, well, don't, because that's not the goal of a 24. It's like a marathon. Like, yes, it's good if you win, obviously, and if you, uh, you know, prepare for a very long time, yes, okay, but that's not the goal. It's it's a 24-hour race. Uh, it's it's just the way I see it, I guess. Yeah, some people are here to let's just to win it. And if they can't do that, then they won't follow the shit. I didn't see the replay of uh, turn one. Who who plowed through the field? Was it a mistake or was it like? No, someone's just trying too hard. Damn. That was a lot of damage. Mr. to get tried to, to drive it, but he couldn't. I was shouting at the screen on my TV <laughs> when I saw that. It just reminded me of any, any LFM lobby. That, that t turn one. It's the beginning of a 24-hour race. And at the start, turn one, you're trying to become a hero of some sort. It makes zero sense. Yeah, it was the same on the Monza race I did yesterday. Deliberately cautious into turn one. There's a gap in the middle and some, someone decided to put their car in it <laughs> and oh cause God. mayhem. Oh, God. Daniel, you're not streaming now, are you? No. I, I wish I can, I can find a way to get the data off of your telemetry into my dashboard so I can see what you're seeing. It's just not possible. How far away is uh, P34? Does it show now in the class opponents? Far away. Do the class opponents work? We're on the same lap as the car in front. I can't tell the gap though. Yeah, no, it is. It, it is. There, we are seven laps behind the leader. Um, but there's no way for me to look at and see like P34. How far? He's in the pits right now. P34. Okay. P34 is in the pits. I just don't. Can't see how far off. Doesn't show it. Hello. No, we're eight laps behind. No, it could be seven because they're all crossing the line now, maybe. I think I'm on the third wind now. Got the second wind about three o'clock this morning. I'm now getting a third. How'd the other race go? Not so good. 
We expected lots of rain, which was going to suit us, and we didn't get any. Really? Yeah. Ah, the weatherman we failed. Yeah, we were taken out twice as well by people who can't break. That was a six-hour race, right? Yeah. How do you manage? Well, it wasn't me on my own, it was me and two other guys. Mm -hmm. Um. Did you, any, did you do any stints yesterday? No. You picked up yeah, yeah. last night yeah. or throughout the day? Yeah, I jumped in the... Um, what time it was now? It was just as it got dark in the server. <laughs> it just it started raining as okay. well. Heavy rain in 30 minutes, wow. <laughs> Maybe you should uh, hop into single player <laughs> and set up a rain session. Looks like you're going to have to do it. Make any changes to the setup, except TC? TC, ABS, brake bias, obviously. Yeah, brake bias all the way to the back, right? Yeah. Go and try and see what you think. Yeah, I'm going to go into a single uh, session and just uh, try it out. Cool. Uh, dropping out of the server, I need to try it out. Let's face it, I might need to drive in the wet. I'll put medium rain, <laughs> and I'll put heavy rain, and the... Uh... Yeah, yeah, the most we've ever seen in this race is medium. All right. So you're using the same exact setup, right? Yes. Yeah. 27.5 all around on the pressures. That's what we're using. Seems to work well. Hey Jason, how you doing man? It is raining. It is raining like crazy. And I haven't done any practice in the wet. And now I'm going into a single session. Just so I can see what it looks like. Because it might mean that I, I will need to drive in the wet. So now I'm just testing the waters. Literally. This is a single session, solo. It's not part of the race. I'm just trying to uh, practice just a bit. Oh shit, it ain't breaking at all. Okay.
TC was at, normally it's at 2. I put it up to 5. And ABS the same. Uh, what I need to do is uh, push and break bias all the way to the rear. Which I'm probably not breaking enough. I'm not sick, no. It's, it's very early in the morning and I'm not shouting because the family... Well, it's 8.30 now. They're probably up now. Oh, shit. Damage is off in my single sessions because of this reason. Alright, I have to... I have to... I have to get used to this. No way. There is zero grip here. Okay. I have to do like a couple of laps. Yeah, man. 7 p.m. there. Go for dinner. I haven't had breakfast yet. Yeah, this is... Complete... Yeah. This is hard. I'll do this lap just to see how everything works. And then I'll do one more lap, hopefully clean. As you can see, it is difficult.
hoot. All right, so part of from a few corners, not completely screwed up. If I go slow enough, it's so uh, it seems to be okay-ish. Okay. Now I'm down the back straight. I want to do one more lap just to see if I can fix those corners and just get a, get used to them. So do one more lap, and I'll let you know. I'll probably jump in. There's no point if you just keep on going. How many laps do you have now? Two. I'll just be very slow. This might even be me in luck because these tires. If you're going, if you, if you're going in now, let me know so I can swap out and join the server so I can just take over. Let's do the swap now. I'm on the GP lab now. It's um, it'll be hey. one complete lap of the large life here. Yeah. Okay. I'm pretty much the same as you then. Of course, I completely outbroke myself, T1. Where do you break in the wet? Uh, um, at the pit exit, at pit entry? <laughs> <laughs> no. Tires are now slicks, I think. They are no longer grooved wets. Oh, Daniel, it's just a game. <laughs> All right, look, I'll jump in. Like once you, once you're ready to uh, near the end, I'm also in the GP track now. I'm just gonna, uh, just gonna go through the. Um, the final it's gonna stop raining in half an hour. Oh yeah, it, it'll never, it'll never start. It'll never stop. So I'm going through the chicane now. I'm gonna go on the Nords and just do a few, as many corners as I can, and then just hand it over to me, and I'll, I, I'll try and not crash it. Basically, I mean, I really want to drive. That's why I woke up at 5:30. <laughs> it's like I want to do this. So. Um, Good morning, boys and girls. Morning, Mr. Git. Morning. I think I've got to sleep about 1 a.m. 
I woke up but was dozing by 4.30. And I didn't have the best thing shit night. I, uh, I did a long blink before. Felt pretty nice. Uh, did you see... I don't know if you see the message in Discord. No. I was saying I should be good to take over the stint after Mr. C. All right, so I'll take uh, I'll take the stint right after Daniel now. He's on his in lap. Mm -hmm. um, it's gonna be wet, but I'm trying to yeah. practice on the wet just a bit now. It seems to be okay. I'm just breaking a lot earlier and uh, being very cautious. Yeah, I did do that. You'll be fine. Yeah. And I'll do one stint, and then I can hand over to you. Mm-hmm. Uh, you know you weigh around the MFD and everything, don't you, to do pressures and shit? You'll tell me what to do, what pressures. Oh, yeah, yeah, obviously, but you know you weigh around it. Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. You yeah, have everything set yeah, up. Yeah, I'll put it. Oh, yeah, cool. Up, down, left, right. Yeah, these tyres did, um... Some of the GP track and they're probably a sector of the nodes. Hmm. While they, were, while they were red hot Oof. out of the pits. Oh and yeah, you uh, did. Yeah, I, you did have them then. Yeah. I'm now feeling the pain. <laughs> There's nothing left on the rear. Yeah, but there must have been nothing left uh, some time now. Because you did, uh, you did a quite long distance with them being red. Yeah, it was a, a full lap of the GP track. Yeah. Plus about a sector of the large lap. And then the rain came down. I'm ready. <laughs> he said laughing very hard. Alright, I'm going to join the server. I read a puncture before as well, Steve. Yeah? Yeah. We got it almost at the start of the Nord. Well, it was probably about five or six corners in the Nord right. Slifer. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to slip out uh, and be right back in two minutes. Yeah, left rear puncture to do three quarters of a lap on three wheels. <laughs> Alright, so it's a proper puncture, that's in tie gun, oh, yeah. not just like proper, pressure. Proper, off. yeah, proper tie gun. And so we came in for new tyres, mm. and it wasn't quite time to. Seventeen, fifteen seconds, ten, nine, three seconds coming past you, seventy, fifteen seconds behind. Yeah, these tyres are done. There is nothing left.
Alrighty, I am back, and I am not ready. Sorry, I am ready. You're in the, Shit, you're but... in the server? Yeah, yeah. He's in the server. Yay. You got uh, two and a half seconds to the car beyond. GT3. Yes. You are requested, wet tires, pressures, fuel. Fuel's done. There is three seconds of damage, but... Oh, well. Could be worse. Why is it switching me out? I, I'm selecting your car, and when I go into drive that mode, did. it switches me out to someone else. Oh god, that bug. Is that going to be when a problem? I count you in. When I count you in... Yep. It'll switch back? Uh, no, but you'll have to um, press shift. Good up. Good up, Jim. Fuck's sake. Um, so when I count you in, you press shift and up, that should then bring you back to this car. Alright, let me try again. So just, selecting your car. Just, just, yeah, just leave yourself where you are now. Press, make sure you press drive and then... Yeah, I'm in drive it. now. I am in drive now. Yeah, that's good. I just can't see what you're doing. That's the whole thing. No, no, that's fine. You, you, you won't see this. Even if you were looking at the car. You won't be able to see the countdown or anything. I have to do. It for no, you. I, I know. I know about that. I just cannot see where you're driving. I'm in someone other. I'm, I'm, in, someone I'm in the pit box. In the pit box. Okay. Fifteen seconds. So when I count, when I when I say over to you, mm -hmm. press shift and up on your keyboard. That should then give you control. Bring the camera back to your car. Five, four, three, two, one. You shift and up. Yep. And then start. Yep. There you go. And we are gone. Yeah, if you don't spin in the pit lane. <laughs> well, I just did just slightly. <laughs> Why do I have yeah, the flash on? The first, yeah, just bend the first lap, just getting it. Keep on the underline, underline, under the line. Yeah. Yeah, you're clear behind. Yeah, it's just that they'll give you a penalty if you cross that up here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's nice and heavy rain too, it's not just rain. Yeah, I've left the indicator on. If you've got it mapped, turn it off. I don't have it mapped, no. I have to, when I'm straight, I'll just do it through the um, FD. Yeah. Alright, well. I'll be very careful. Yeah, you've got plenty of um, new cat behind you. restart my game because um put the bloody power in, in the dash and it's windowed me but that bloody bar at the top of it. So i'll rejoin in just a second uh, you want to turn the indicator off pretty soon because you've got leaders coming up behind they will think you're going to go right Where's my indicator? Off. Oh, okay, got it. There it right. You've got P9 coming up behind you. Shortly followed by P4 and P10. But the 10 seconds off. Yeah, well, they catch it pretty quick. Yeah, okay. They'll, they'll be on you before you know it. So you just, uh, I'll let you know when they get really close. So the, the briefing said it's down to you to pick where you're going to pick your line mm -hmm. and you're going to get away, so pick a line and stay there. So if you're going to go left, go left and stay there, make sure you indicate as well if you if you can. I don't or have a make, map, or, so... Or to make it obvious, that's what you're doing. Yeah. And they will go around you.
if they've just exited the last turn where you were. Shit. Oh, man. Stay left, stay left, stay left. Stay left. There's one. Go. One more coming. Stay where you are. Clear. Damn it, that, that turn. Yeah, he needs to break and downshift for it. Early. And this left hand is going to be mindful. And this one too, huh? Mm. Yeah, break and downshift, yeah. Early. Bring the gas in steadily. Break, 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 break. There you go. Okay, four seconds to the uh, next car. Seconds. Stay right. Yeah. I can't control the car like this. I, I will, I mean, don't, it's just that it was. Uh, don't, don't cut too much, I shall get a penalty. Go. Alright, let's see. If you don't have anyone behind me, I won't get spooked again. Yeah, you've got a big gap now, 15 seconds. Well, it's one way to learn the track. Sorry for the damage. How much is it? Uh, it says 12 seconds, so I'm assuming it's okay. 12 seconds. Early, early, early. Yeah, that's the one where you're always a bit too yeah, late. Yeah, yeah I, I, that's, the, that's the one that I'm always wary about, though. It's like, I know I can't break there. Um, always being a bit too careful there now. Yeah, you've got to be patient with that one. It's all about the exit, because then the exit leads up here. Uh, GC4 is behind aren't catching, so you've got plenty of time. The next GC3 is about 40, 40 seconds back. I don't want to get too carried away. Every time I think I'm doing good. That, yeah, that right hander just then always catches this car out. Especially <laughs> oh when I'm driving. Careful with it. Can't use those curves, you just got to be careful. I have friends hooked on the YouTube corner now. Mm 
Okay, this is going to be my pace. This is going to be it. So, if it's okay. What do you do with a jump in the rain? Lift. Lift and break. Alright. Yeah, you lift before the jump. And you land, break down to fourth. Lift to these, lift to these. Feather the throttle. So it still keeps the weight over the rear a little bit. So you're not um, rotating too much as you're turning and jumping. Mm -hmm. This is uh, fourth gear. Very gentle on the brakes. Third. Yeah. Try and put the pace a little bit, the GC4s are catching you know. Yeah. Third for this, third. Careful the grass on the outside. And a big lift in the middle. And go. Yeah, I don't know if I can pick up the pace much. I mean I can I can do my best, that's that's what I can say. How are the pressures? Uh, 284, 286 in the rear, 288 in the rear. Stay off, stay off sunny water then. Mm. You need to keep as much temperature as you can. Yeah, they're going to drop a lot now. Yeah, if you stay off the sunny water, you'll be okay. So where you are now, where it's... Yeah. Stay on that. A uh, slight lift to these two corners. Move on for this one. And then start breaking. Second. Can use that curb on the inside. Mm -hmm. Yes, there's a lot. Right now. Don't touch that outside curb, otherwise you will go straight up. Careful of that first curve on the chicane. Yeah. I've been hitting it all day. I'm trying to avoid it. Um, the truth is, this is a right-handed steering wheel. <laughs> so I, I always forget that I have more space on my left than I... I, I don't have enough space on my left, basically. Don't forget now after the after the jump at the top. Breaking downshift. There you go. Just a small small break. Downshift one. 
and you can start bringing the gas in then. It just gives you enough to get through. But yeah. Okay. Normally in the dry, for me it's a lift. Yeah, I lift the, there, but... The fast guys, it's flat. But flat there? Really? Yeah. Breaking down shit. Stop raining inside 10 minutes. No, I, I knew that was coming. Careful. Yeah. Again. Uh, no. Come on. Now we got a bunch of GT3s coming up, right? Mm hmm. Perfect. Three seconds behind. Next up, first one. It's just behind you now. Yeah. You've got 28 seconds behind now.
kind of just behind you. Yep.
So when you're on dot and draft it would best get the changes made for the yep. stop. When you get back on the street, let me know. Mm-hmm. Uh Daniel, what we're we doing for the pressure is about twenty seven five because we're going wet again by the look of it. Peter told me that for wet it's twenty seven five. Yeah. Uh, yeah, because it's increasing. So yeah, um, Pressures between seven and five all round. Uh, select obviously wets and fill it up to one twenty. Yeah, I'll do that once I get in straight. So they're wet 27.5. All round. Yeah, all round. And I'm selecting you as a driver. Mm -hmm. Wet. And 120, and 120 litres. Yep. All full oh, now. Cool. All right, yep. Just concentrate and then... Uh not on my in, in lab now. No, 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 no. Time to get ready now and then don't have to worry about it. Absolutely. And then if something happens, you we know, we're ready it. just to. Yeah. The only thing is, if you have an incident and you have to return to pits, then you will have to um, carry on. You can't request when you're in the pits. So let me just check everything is re ready. 120, wet. Yeah. We're good. Alright, jump. Not pleasant to drive, um, mm. but manageable now. Like, this is my third lap now. Mm. Yeah, yes, I mean, you're getting used to it. It takes you, like, you just use your first lap as just to get a feel for things, and then, you know... Yeah, but just imagine that this is my first ever lap in the mm. wet in an orchard life. So it wasn't... It's not like I had to get used to something. I had to learn mm. things. <laughs> mm. All right. Hopefully I won't make any more mistakes. Pressures um, are a uh, bit low, though, just so you know. They're like, yeah, they're, they're maxing at not 29. Oh, they're like 29, yeah? Yeah, they're currently 29 right now. 28, 9 in the rear, 
29 in the front. So it's, yeah, I mean, you may want to maybe we increase that. Um, I'll keep an eye on but track temperature is 14. I gave you 27 dead the last stop. Oh, 27. Okay, so now we're up yeah. by 0. 0.5. So it should be okay so then. 20 yeah, 27 8 should be all right, but especially with the walk, with the uh, temperature um, increasing. Yeah. All right, so I can uh, I can increase it then just a bit. I was finding 27.5 was getting towards the top end of 30s for me. Yeah. All right. Well, we're, as I said, we're, yeah, we leave it on 27.5. Yeah. Because obviously we've um, they're gonna warm up pretty quickly at the minute because it stopped raining. Yeah, but there's rain in 30 minutes. Well, yeah, no, that's, that's probably going to be about 20 minutes, so... Stuck. More rain. It's been like that all night, not on off. All on. night. <laughs> we got... I got about 40 minutes of the dry mm -hmm. And I've got to stop going Thursday anyway <laughs> for my troubles. Yeah. <laughs> for, yeah. Yeah, we were very optimistic. Ooh. We said basically we'll wait till it gets dry so I can take the car, and that's not going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't doing. It kept going. We try in a minute, and then it'll be wet again. Yeah. We'll try in a minute, and it's going to be wet again. We've tried a few times on slicks, but it just doesn't work. You just got to run the wets and trash them, unfortunately. Get more confident through there, Constantinos. Uh, it was my first wet lap. Sorry. Yeah, I mean, it's, um... Yeah, getting confident in general. And it's still, it's drying a bit more, so there's a bit more grip to be found everywhere. If it doesn't rain quick, then these tires are going to be dead. It's uh, trying very fast, and the pressures are going up as well. That's fine. They, they, they actually hold on remarkably well. It's if you do what I did, where the, you murder them at the start of the stint, and they go off at the end. Yeah, so drying the wet will shorten them, but wetting to dry is fine. You go GG, three, five seconds behind. Uh, and another one, it's two the, seconds behind that. It's the Jardier car coming up behind. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Shit. No, no, don't, don't, don't touch, don't touch, don't touch, don't touch. Don't touch. Ah, oh, I touched. Where are they now? Go, 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 go. seconds to... Stay right, stay right, stay right, stay right. I have to stay here. There you go. There. One more shortly. Yeah, three, two seconds behind. Right, I'll just stay on this side, let him go. Alright. 24 seconds for the next one. Alright. Loads of time. Dead. Right, I'm getting out of the rig. Ah, uh, okay.
if we got a lead of five sec four seconds behind. Yeah, yeah, that's on 3.3. Just behind you now. Yep, staying on the right. Oh, careful. Oh, God. Well, it's up John, whenever you feel like it, I'm ready to take over whenever. That's so light rain in 10 minutes. Alright, um, uh, this is my fourth lap, I think. Mm -hmm. Maybe I can keep it up just, just you know, as much as I can. If it's going to start raining heavy again, I'll probably just uh, give it to you. It's light rain in 10, increasing light rain in 30. All right, maybe I'll just do a couple more laps. Mm -hmm. And now it's showing no rain in 30 minutes. All right. Well, if it's Not if true. it's going to dry up, we'll still need to um, stop for slicks then. Mm. You just let me know what changes I need to do. Mm-hmm.
Oh man, again. Couple of GT threes coming up, two and four seconds behind. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Thanks. One point nine. Okay, they're lucky. Keep to the right. Yep. I have to cool down my tires, that's why I'm staying on the wet. Mm. Yeah, maybe give it a little lift so I can get past before a drop. A pair of them actually. Yeah, we're clear. That's one, another one coming. Both of them are gone now. That was nice and clean. It says 10 rain, 30 sun. Mm -hmm. Nice. Well, it's not sun, it's cloud, so the rain's... Well, no rain at least. Probably can we stay as we are with the, set of the um, changes? I think it's likely going to rain. We should get another update on the next lap.
Nice to Where? They're battling ahead, and they're not giving up way at all. They get one a strike. Yeah. You're not far off of it. Yeah, yeah. Let them fight, give them some room, because I don't think it's going to end well for them. I don't want to be caught up in this. How much fuel we got left? Uh, three laps left, fuel, and I'm on the seventh lap now. So I'm, this one will be my end lap, okay? Okay. Yeah, let his car pass. Yeah. Go on, go on. Let me know if you want me to change anything for the settings. Otherwise, uh, okay. I'll let me keep an eye on the weather. It hasn't changed in my end. I haven't seen anything. That's decreasing rain in 10.
I think we're gonna have to, I don't know, come, just, just worry about dying or I think. Um, GT three two seconds behind. You about me, Guy? I've got some of the stream. More GT freeze three seconds and seven seconds behind. All right. Sitting in 35th at the minute, probably um, where we're going to finish maybe, but we're still going, that's it. It's just behind you. Yeah. So Wayne's looking at the minute. Dry tyres 26 all round. Now? Seriously? Oh, yeah. Alright. Could we got no rain in 10. 
it's like do it on straight, not now. Uh, oh oh. shit. Yeah, of course. Anyone coming? Can't see. Eight set for five seconds. Stay there, stay there. Can't see anyone. Go, go, go. Fee subscription from Turbo Center. Oh my god, it's wrecked. Uh, you got a fake second behind. Damn yeah, it. Just take it, easy to, just take it easy to the pits. Yeah, I'll go to the side. Stay off the garage because you probably have our arms just spinning. So you want 26 all around? Yeah. We've got no rain in 10, no rain in 30. Once it changes. Just let me know if anyone's coming behind me. Seven seconds. Okay, we're on a straight now, so that's, that's good. Sorry for bringing you in a car with so much damage. Uh, well, it's repaired, isn't it? Are the repairs checked? Yeah, everything's checked. Alright. Alright. Let me know, tires. Yeah, take the slicks and um, it 26. 26 all around. Dry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Fuel is at 120. Steve Maz is selected. Mm -hmm. Suspension and bodywork fixes. It's a lot of damage. 1.3 minutes. One and a half minutes, sorry. Yeah, be careful around here. Um, you've got a car behind you, two seconds, two, two, three. Just be careful. Keeping clear. Other car just behind. Yep, seeing him. Oh, go on, do, what do, happened? do, do, go. I'm coming in. Uh, change tires, dry 26 all around. 120. Tire set 2. Do you want to change tire set? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm looking at the thing. Tire set 2. That's what you want, right? That's fine. Just dry is fine. Don't worry about tire sets. Just as long as you select dry. Yeah. That's just going to be fun. Okay. Why isn't the oh shit? En engine. No, it did engine off. It just didn't go up. Didn't go up. Is it up now? Yeah, yeah, it's up now. One minute thirty seconds. Mm -hmm. Again, sorry for bringing in a car as bad as I did. Decreasing, it's dry, dry. So yeah, got to go. So just got to risk it for a biscuit. Oh, one minute. Turning ignition on. I can't select gear. But oh, you don't select gear. Just it's fine. It's in reverse. I don't know if it's going to go in the neutral for you. Just know it's in reverse right now. Mm -hmm. The ignition is on. 40 seconds. It was in reverse. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> I had to reverse into the box. 
Anyway, okay. have a good one. Sorry. At least we're still in P-35. That's mean Ty's gonna warm up really quickly. Alright guys, uh, that was a hard one. I haven't done, I'm not confident enough with, um, switch over. I'm not confident enough in, uh, on Nordschleife, much less with the Bentley. My first stint I did was in full wet. It went as good as you'd uh, expect it would. Pretty much so. Unfortunately, I returned a really badly damaged car. Which, uh, not much I can do, to be honest. Yeah, the next one is pretty much far away, still. It's sketchy, but okay, sketchy. I mean, pressures are. Are they going up? Pressures? Way down. No, 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 no. They're, they're, they're sort of bottomed out. Oh, God. You think it'll but, dry out fast enough? Yeah, it's fine. You know, once it dries out a bit. Just don't the guesstimate pressures were about right. 
I mean, it, it was a right call. Much would have been destroyed. Hmm. Yeah, if, the, if the tractor dries out pretty fast, then it's a good call to go on slicks. Uh, mm. Anything up there? Yeah. It yeah, we seems got to be drying coming out in 30, so, yeah. Hopefully, I can keep the slicks cool. They've got to be well over pressured, probably towards the end of the stint. <clears throat> hello. Yep. Hello. Hello. Uh, am I needed for any more stints now? Do you want me to hang around? Or... Uh. Is, uh, I don't know what. Coming back. What time meet you coming back? Did you say? He didn't say. When he wakes up. Well, I can double stint if need be. We just made a swap. Um, had a bit of damage. <clears throat> Gone straight onto slicks as the rain stopped. Guestment pressures are 26. It's sunny all the way through on the weather at the moment, so. I'm hoping they won't be too hot by the time we get towards the end. I mean, if anything, as I said, I can double stint if Mickey doesn't come back. And, and then... if it's dry, I'd be a bit more confident as well. I think we're stuck with dry, wet, dry, wet, dry, wet, unfortunately. Well, damp, wet, damp, wet, damp, wet. I think that's what we're stuck with. Which is slowly creeping up, pretty equal all round, which is good. Good clean my glasses are filthy. Hi right, Pete. Strong gunno going, definitely. <laughs> Before, and I still got a nice cold beer at the back of it. That was a bit sketch. You got more incoming, one second behind.
Put it in throw. It's gone. Next one is in uh, three seconds. Is that more rain coming in half an hour? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> lovely. Yeah, lovely. I'm also trying to debug the uh, the dashboard. <laughs> My God, what is wrong with it? Next one is 50 seconds behind now, to be clear. Is the track getting any better? A little bit. Very slowly heating up. Not by much, but it's heating.
before I was just past me, just spun it at carousel. Mm -hmm. Still behind you though. One second. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Don't do it.
wait for the next update on the bloody rain. He is right on your tail. Mm -hmm. <coughs> you got a good gap now behind you. Mm -hmm. And it's now light raining 30, so the risk is going. Looks so like you might have lucked out going on slips. Well, that thing's pretty dry, so you're pretty good now. So mm. next stint, we'll probably be wet again. Or damp at least. I mean, it went from heavy rain to light rain. He's on slicks because he's cooling, he's on wets because he's cooling them off. Yeah. I'm hoping the next update will show no rain, just cloud, and that'll be a big result. Yep, he really managing those. Yeah, going left and right. Yep, no rain. Alrighty then. Came on. Come on, Slick, it's time to do your stuff. Oh, get 
in there. Give an APS. Tires won't get eight up. I'm sitting like twenty three five for about the last fifteen minutes. Twenty three five. Wow. Yeah, I'm just being mindful of the curves so we don't get so puncture. Daniel got one of those. No, I think you got a full puncture. I'm on the back, you know, pressure loss. Yeah. Uh try your fifth site go. We're still going. I think everyone at some point has had a whoopsie. Uh, but yeah, we're still going. I went on to a just stopped raining session on slicks. It was showing heavy rain in 30 about a quarter an hour ago, but now it's gone to a nothing. Completely guesstimated my tyre pressures. Uh, they flatly refused. Oh, actually, no, they've gone up point three. Um, I'm hoping as we get to the end of the session. Things will uh, level up. It, you know, might have been better to go on things, but you know, just. We're not fighting for wins, we're just fighting to survive. Drive to survive! does say light rain or something in 10 minutes but then it's clearing out yeah, yeah. probably be a brief shower p32 ahead has a 10 second uh, penalty and he's on the same lap as us is he yep what 30 second 10 second no, but yeah, you said 32nd, does it, oh, is it, what, what, he's in 34th? He's in 32nd place. Yeah. P32. We're on the same lap with them. Is he a GT3? Uh, 32nd, yeah. So where's the cars, um, 33, 34? They're ahead of us. Well, 30, P33 is a GT4. Or whatever that green one is. Well, the green one is... It's a Porsche Cup, yeah. 34 is... He... Uh, 34 just crossed the finish line, start finish line. So that's how far away they are. Yeah. But we're on the same lap. Like, I think we're on mm. the same lap up to a P31, I think. Still anything, there's still a lot a lot to play. I mean there's oh, yeah. yeah, five hours and yeah, we got yeah. There's a lot. A lot to win, but a lot to lose. Mm-hmm. Oh, we're coming up to uh 34 degrees, oh, 24, uh, 24, sorry. If I can track take this a long lot of dry out.
So what have you got planned for uh, the dash coming up? Any spicy changes? Uh, the last one had... I included temperatures for Celsius, Fahrenheit, and Kelvin. Basically anything that the... Uh, that SimHub supports. So now if you switch in the main settings, global settings to Fahrenheit, for instance, uh, pressures and tire temps and everything. Well, pressures, you can change from PSI to bar, um, but the color of the uh, the wheels won't look red. Like if you went to Fahrenheit, they all looked red even when they were normal because, you know, it was only looking for Celsius. Um, I fixed that. Uh, upcoming features, I really... Well, I need to pause work on the dashboard. I need to work on the pit wall. That's, uh, I really need to work on the pit wall. It's been kind of left behind with all the changes and Nord Schleifen. So, pit wall is going to support multi-class, which is, uh, I already have it in, on mine. It doesn't work really well. It's still kind of buggy. It's, you wouldn't believe, like, you'd think these things are really simple. Oh, just put multi-class. But then you get into the edge cases and you realize how hard it is. So the pit wall, the next version of the pit wall, will support normal leaderboard, uh, multi-class leaderboard and map, uh, and will also have better support for iRacing. So ACC and iRacing more compatible. Mm. I think that's going to be the next thing. And you also see that. See, I released now the 2.6.4, which had a whole bunch of fixes and uh, some changes to the track opponents and class opponents, and it's still not working right. Mm. And as much as I want to go back to the pit wall, I still need to fix these. And now I'm doing a lot of. T I'm going to record my next stint, whenever that is. I'm going to record telemetry uh, for seven laps, whatever that is, so I can have some mm. information because the data is not returning correct. And I don't know if it's me or if it's um, or if it's ACC or SimHub or who's who's at fault. I actually made some changes now. While I was uh, quiet, I made some changes to the dashboard. I want to see what's what numbers it's going to give me for estimated lap time now, because I made some changes. Are the tires up to pressure now? Oh, wait a second. No. <laughs> Trouble answer. Well, yeah. I thought 26 would have been enough, but, you know, what do I know? Seriously, before I run it, because I'm not, uh, get to say then. Thank you. You have P20 at 5 seconds. Mm-hmm. Alright, I'm going to take a really quick break. Mm-hmm, yep, sure. Uh, I'll be back in, like, you know, maybe 10 minutes nice. max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be back in a lap. <laughs> okay. All right, uh, chatting everyone. Hey, Zinzimoni. It is your favorite car? I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm, I'm having trouble. And I and this is a track I don't know really well, a car that I don't really know how to drive well, and my stint was in full wet. It didn't go as I'd want it to go. Anyway, I'm taking a five-minute break. I'll be right back.
He thought about going for a... Thank you, sir. Oh, here comes the rain again. Well, I've really pushed it red. Go on, bye bye. Pretty sure in ten minutes. Come in and change tyres. One second.
Oh, the the chap who actually designed this dashboard, he's just gone. He'll be back in a minute. He can fill you. He'll come fill you in. I had to change the wets. It is, it is very, very good. Oh. Alright, let's come in and change then, those six weren't going nowhere. We tried. Andres. Did you see your livery on the clip in Discord? Seven five is too high. Yeah, but you know, you didn't have no time to do anything. But yeah, look, look, looks good.
Hello. Yo. I was on slicks, but the rain was too to come around bad, so. Yeah. I pitted, topped up, took wet 27.5 too high, so probably 26.5. No, but the rears, 26. Actually, no, probably 25.5. Fronts on 27.5. I'll check on them on straight. Uh, yes, uh, we go two pairs after the 25.5, 31 and a half, and 32. So, yeah, you want to go definitely 25.5 on the rears, maybe 26 on the fronts. For these conditions, anyway. Got you in the traffic. I have to come in and change for wets. All right, I have a change of plan. Mhm. Mm I can do two more stints, um, but they have to be somewhere uh -huh. near. Is it going to be raining for a long time? You don't uh, know. it's no. Rain should be stopping soon.
I've only done my out mapping, this is my first flying lap, so I've done one at my eight. Mm -hmm. So if the next stint, if it's, mm -hmm. I wish it's dry, if it's dry, can I take it? Yeah, 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 sure. Uh, I wish it's dry. This is like, okay, I get it. It's raining, but it can't be always raining. I mean, come on. I mean, we're not a spa. I know, right? Is uh, Mickey going to join? Uh, I assume so when he wakes up. Okay. Because I said I have a change of plan, unfortunately. You know, uh, Emily, mm -hmm. Sunday. Uh, so I can do one or two stints. Um, but then I have to go. Mm hmm Last night I had the stream on from ACC, the official ACC stream, and um, our car had some really good airtime. Mm, yeah. Someone put a link, but I don't know if it's the same one that I was looking at. They they was, they, was, they, was, they was put it in yet. It was focused on you. You were driving it. I was for quite. It was like a full lap, I think. But I couldn't hear what they were saying, like if they were actually, you know. Um, mm commentating on you or just uh, the camera was there and they were just you know talking about stuff I'll go back and find it Well driven Porsche Cup that is. Yeah. Porsche Cup, I, I had the Porsche Cup for a season on Box Motorsports. I took a mm -hmm. part. That car wanted to kill me every single turn. The Cup car. My god. And you've got a GT3, uh, mm -hmm. it's about like 5 seconds behind, not 1.3, you just passed the, uh, the GT4 behind you. Oh, he's sliding a lot. Yeah, we are way over pressured now. But it's better than under pressured slicks, put that way. Mm. Hey Bruno, how you doing, man? Any sign of uh, Pete or uh, Scott? No. We'll be tagging in Discord for you. <clears throat> We're currently in P35 after whew, a whole bunch of hours. Um, there's four hours, 45 minutes left. Um, we're on the same lap up to P31, I think. Last time I was, ch I checked. Isn't it going? Oh shit! What the hell? Is... What was that? Holy! Okay, that was good. That was good. He came in a bit hot. 
Yeah, the stint panel says Konstantinos is in next, then mm. finish yeah. after that. Yeah, um, I'm going to do, if it's, uh, hopefully it'll be dry. I really hope it's dry. Just not, if it's wet, I'll still take it. Um, but I just hope it's dry. I'll take one, the next stint, and then I have to go. I won't be able to stick around for the entire thing. I'll probably leave my stream running. Uh, but I need to, I'll take one more stint, but then I have to go. Plans have changed, unfortunately. Well, fortunately, but unfortunately for the race. Mickey's also going to join, right? Just making sure. At the minute, it's not showing any rain for the next 30 minutes. With my luck, we'll have a lot of rain. Morning, Pete. Keep an eye on the weather. So far, it's just cloudy. Oh, say pins, are you still in chat, mate? I completely forgot to uh, get back to you. Draw if he is or not. Oh man, sorry to hear that, yeah. Bruno. He was asking about the dash. Say it looked cool. I said you just got away. I've got to. Hey man, I'm I'm, I'm here. Back. I'm here. I was just talking to my chat as well. Uh, yeah, I was trying. He was in my Twitch chat. He was just um, probably about 15 minutes ago while he was AFK. I'm just watching this Porsche cup in front of me and just thinking, how the kids he managed to keep it on track? Oh, there he is, there he is. He just, yeah, jinxed it. <laughs> but he still, he kept it on. Oh, he kept it on track, though. Yeah, what have you done to me, mate? Hey? Yeah, pressure's on. Way high. For these conditions, damp track. What, 20 some 5 whoa, you're whoa, whoa, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Be careful. Yeah. Well, 
Took a bit of a whack there. Huge. Hit the curb, went in the air, and landed on the wall. Mm. Oh, he makes it through here. <laughs> Could just go straight. There he is again. He's drifting. Uh, Bruno, this is this is this is the. Uh, this car here, army. I think it's the TRS XL. It's it's a large one. It's a large one. Though. I don't oh, remember yeah. exactly. It's Thank it's you, an sir. older version. I got it oh, much cheaper than you'd get a new one. Um, but it's basically the same one. I I remember which model it is. I I don't to be honest. I don't remember. But it's it's a wide one. It's comfortable, very comfortable. It's just very warm in the summertime. Let's get you in the front should, end now. Should be careful about that. It's kind of warm during the summertime. Your sim magic extension, man. You've had some series of bad luck. When I got my th my triple thirty twos, they arrived from the same store, and one of them was cracked down the middle. And then I had to not. Y you can return it, obviously. It's looking they like told it's going to be slick. I'd have to return what it. What you're working on the pressures. I have to return yeah, it, right, they always and then they had to check it in um, it two, three weeks. Any so spells up Sorry. for thirty minutes from now? Whenever we've tried running the slicks, the pressures have always just dropped right down to nothing. All right, so well, let me know what you want, and uh, I'll shove it in. Am I getting in, or I'd I'd, uh, I'd probably get in if 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 you yeah. guys are okay with that. Yeah. Uh, weather shows. Sunny with a chance of uh, meatballs, uh, just some slight clouds, basically. So I think mm. it'll be good. If it's um, been raining, you'll want pressure in the tires. Yeah, if it's raining and I'm on slicks, you'll want more than that. You'll want a miracle. <laughs> uh, it's the track seems to be okay now. Yeah, I think that's where the puncture came from. Not putting enough in. So how much did you have? Twenty-seven five? No, that's yes, too much. Yes, I had Wets. For wets, yeah. For dries, 26. And they're very yeah, low now. Well but the track is also, it's 18, it's damp. So... The, the pressures that I used are in the Discord tracks. Um, go to 24, chat in, let's get to Discord. Again. Yeah, yeah. Um, which one was it? 11, 11 was 26, 8, 27, 1, 26, 26, 7. Um, yeah, the, the temperature's way higher than that. Oh man, this guy's yeah. Okay, bye. Oh, wasn't surprised, but he was doing well. Yeah, shit happened to uh, the best of us. Yeah, he was pushing a lot though. That guy was pushing a mm. lot. Actually, trying to catch up for the. Uh, he must be leading. Jet. What position was he in? Uh, P45. That was Steinbrenner, I think. Still behind you. Mm. P45. Yeah, it wasn't in a... He was just pushing. <laughs> yeah, our rears are toasty. Is this your in-lap or are you going to... how many laps? No, 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 no. I went to a store, Bruno. Right, what do you want for the pressures? Um, Daniel, what do you consider? Because the last one was 11-11 temperature, which is fairly cold to what we have now. And it's probably going to rise as well, yeah. the temperature. Are you taking slicks? Yes. Yeah, it's it's going to be dry. For those pressures that I took, they just always dropped to 23, 24 anyway. Really? The track was damp and, and wet, yeah. Um, 
track is much warmer now, though. It was 11, now it's, it's 7 degrees up from then. You can try and repeat those pressures. They will what ones? Up. Uh, so, if you want to drop your MFD up. Yep, go on. Front left, front left, front right. 20. 26, 8. On front left, front right. 27, 1. Right, give me a second. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, left rear. 26 zero. Mm hmm. 26 seven. So those, were, those are the pressures I, I was using in practice this morning before I jumped back in. Repeat. We've got no damage. Crested. <clears throat> Post your ears. Oh, uh, no, where it went. Interesting. Be careful. Yeah, definitely coming in this lap. All right, chat. This is going to be my last stint. It's Keep my second and last stint. I won't have enough time to do anything else. So, um, yeah, we'll be driving one more stint, and this is it. Hopefully, it'll remain dry. Honestly, the first one was wet, and it was just, you know, it was awful. I don't know if you've got any other changes. Um, no. no. Pressure's... Oh, pressure's cool, yeah. Right, we're good then. You didn't have any damage, you did a good job. Hopefully I can bring it back like that. Conditions at the moment is like the old 1970s shampoo advert. Oh, it's greasy, aren't they? <laughs> You'd have to look it. Oh, if you look up on YouTube, you'll see the reference. I'm sure it's the 1970s. Might have been Fred and Shoulders, actually. <clears throat> so, right, we're going to work out our combined ages. So, uh, I'm 58. How old are you two? I am uh, ten years, ten years senior to you, forty-eight. <clears throat> uh, ten years, you junior, not senior. Sorry. <laughs> Hi, Reggie. Forty-eight. Uh, all right, mate. All right. Um, we we're on wet on a dry track, so it's interesting. We're just actually getting together at our combined ages. I think Mink. I'm not sure, Minky. I don't know about Scotty either. So what was that say? We were on 58 and I'm 48. 48, yeah. 21. Can someone do the mental maths? And who, how about Daniel? 106. 21. That's 106. And Daniel is? 21. Uh, <laughs> times 2. How old are you? You're asking us? Yes, I am. I've been up on Okay. That's the same thing I do with my wife. I always ask her, how old am I? So that is 106 of 87. Uh, that'd be uh, 143. Right, so we're, our combined age of free drivers is 143. And we've still got two more drivers to add. Mm-hmm. And do we win something if that number is really high? Is it? Is it how you get? It's is it how you how you? Oh shit! What the hell? What the hell? Oh. I think he lost it on the grass. 
I think he just lost because he wasn't going straight. Because yeah, he had he, a lot of... He was carrying damage. He, he was going very slow. I mean, the car probably pulled in front of you. Yeah, he became lots of damage. I think he either lost it or he got a wheel on the grass and it flicked. Oh, well, never mind. Uh... We were saying about the damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I spoke too soon. I spoke too soon. Track has gone from damp to greasy now. All right. Air temp is going so, up. Mm-hmm. So I think our combined age is of what we're on at the moment. 143. I think we're going to be around about... 240. 20-ish combined age. Okay. I reckon. Dinosaurs. We could have been all together a single turtle. Mm. So basically, the oldest team in the slowest car, or one of the slowest cars, it's got to be worth something. Which actually makes <laughs> some, it makes some sense, you know? Mm. The oldest team in the slowest car, Sunday drivers, it kind of makes sense. I was out grocery shopping. Don't know how I got in one of these. We are in P34 now. What did it do? Pit? Mm -hmm. What happened? How are you doing anyway, right? Oh, that serious feels a bit if. Alright, do you want the pressures changed or kept as they are? I'll just trust Daniel on this one. He had his pressures on way colder uh, conditions, and they were very low. So now we're seven degrees up on track, six in air. So hopefully they'll uh, they'll be okay. Fingers crossed. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Hmm. Interesting. When you say interesting. I, I, I get anxious. <laughs> now the front tires feel like you're eating a Mars bar with a wrapper still on. <laughs> you, you know, you, you're doing something, but you just can't tell what. Have you ever tried it? Unwittingly, most likely, in my youth. <laughs> which, frankly, was quite, quite a long while ago. Considering I'm pretty much into my 50th year of gaming. Gaming for 50 years. Jesus. That's what bugs me, you know, about people, they say, oh, this hasn't got, oh, this tree isn't modelled correctly, oh, you know, they haven't yeah. got this star positioned in the sky right. I was watching... You get to play fucking Pong for three years I or was, something. I was watching um, Dan Suzuki's uh, stream, because he was on a Norch Life, and, you know, Dan mm. Suzuki's an iRacing fellow, and his chat is more like, you know, iRacing fanboys or whatever. Mm, yeah. And they were bashing ACC on every turn. Like, I was looking at the chat, and everyone was like, oh, look, the trees look like cardboard. Um, the glares, what is that, fog? Why is there fog? And actually, the, the, the well, image it's, it's was fog, really good. It's foggy. Yeah, but it was really good. Like, half of the track was foggy, the rest was clear, and everyone was bashing at it, saying, like, oh, it's fog, or is it just blurry? And I'm thinking, no. you, haven't yeah, played an, um, no. you haven't played on an Amiga, or much less yeah. on an Atari. You haven't, so, got, you know. 20, we got 23 uh, seconds damage. I will take cardboard looking trees which they don't look like cardboard by the way <laughs> i'm fine with that so i'm coming in real set Check. Yeah, right, fuel. 
pads. I'm set. Lovely. Uh, all right, great stint. Unfortunate at the end. That guy? Uh, just, just one of those things, I'm on full. And, oh, I'll double, double stacked on a bloody thing, so decent sort of repairing. Ah, uh, go get some toast now. Switch over cameras, and everything seems to be fine. <clears throat> 30 seconds. Twenty seconds. No rain due for the next thirty minutes. Ten seconds. Track is greasy. Five, four, three, two, one. Off you go. Why isn't it starting? Okay. Eh. That's it, get used, just use the outlet just to suss the conditions. Yeah, yeah. Keep under the line. Well, it's got more grip already than the wet. <laughs> Okay, for the next 30 minutes, call it the MFD. Right, I'm going to have to get some uh, breakfast. Yeah. I'll be back in a bit. See you later.
<clears throat> Daniel, you there? Uh, yes, can you hear me? Yeah, I was just about to say that you kind of nailed the pressures. They're good. Say again, sorry? Yeah, I'm saying you kind of nailed the pressures. They're in a oh, really good. good place. Yeah, yeah, they're in a really good place. I got, uh, I got Jardia right behind me now. Oh, yeah, try not to crash it. Too. <sighs> I'll try not to crash him. <laughs> I don't want to be that guy. And it's two point two seconds. He's yeah, fast. <laughs> oh, they are. They are ridiculous. <laughs> I like it on his streams. He's always like, "I'm not fast. I'm so slow." I mean, yeah. Okay. Sure. Whatever. All right, I'm set. I'll let him go right there. Good. As I said, I don't want to be that guy. Pressures, if you look at my stream, they're they're hovering just under 27. Depending, like if and they don't drop too much on the um, on the straight, so they're good. Nice. That's good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the ones I used from practice before I uh, got into the nighttime stuff. They should at least work in the dry, at least anyway. All the you know, um, damp air greases the dry. No, it's I ideal. Oh, that's good. Yeah, we um, we tried using them during the overnight bit where it was transitioning from greasy because it took so long. The pressure just fell out of them. It was ridiculous. I saw them pump thing. track uh, temp has increased and it's now at optimum levels. Nice. It'll rain again at some point now. And just hopefully not on my hands. <laughs> Nothing goes. No, that was that was a traumatic experience, honestly. First stint oh, in the rain. <laughs> and it wasn't just rain, it was it was pouring. I quite like the rain at the for it's um Fun. As a view, yeah, it looks beautiful. Yeah, that's it. Did you watch the stream from last night where I did my first stint? Uh, it was on all night, so I probably did. I did I see it, yeah, yeah, I did see it, yeah. Yes, yeah, so Dave handed over to me. It was at the, the part where it starts to get dark. And yep. For some reason, the headlights don't really seem to work. Highlight. Until yeah, until you get to an hour or so after that, and then they seem to work, and you can see where you're going. <laughs> oh, so at the twilight, it's kind of like no light. Yeah, the lights don't work really. There's no there's no light from anywhere else in the track, and the headlights don't really see in the in the run don't seem to function properly. I found it a bit odd. It might have been the eyes, but I don't know. Nice. I did the exact same thing for another GT3 car. Took the high road. Nice. Everyone's just uh, cruising to the, to the finish now, is it? Half nine. I'll tell you, this is far more enjoyable than the previous stint. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but it is. I'm feeling good. Still don't like the Bentley, don't get me wrong. Don't say that. I have to. I have to. They'll love you off, they'll love you off the track if you say it. Yeah, well. Hopefully Scott comes back soon and I can go and have a sleep. You haven't slept oh. yet, huh? Uh, I snuck a little nap in the office chair. Yeah, I was close. Very close. Ah, oh, yeah, so the cup car just passed me again. 
surprisingly fast in some conditions, so those cup cars. Uh, I had to let the GT3 car pass because it was much faster and he just... Uh, <clears throat> don't, don't stay away from me. Thank you. You need to be on the lookout for a purple GT4 McLaren. I think we're racing the position. He's coming up. It's got a... Um, Boothby in it, Malinowski and... Uh, oh, you, you, <laughs> yes, I will hold Malinowski behind me. I will. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> That's going to happen. Hello. I think they're trying to, um, they're trying to catch us while we're having our dramas. You'll take me here, it's on a straight, man. Be patient. Go. Oh well. He's a bit too far. He's not passing. He's gonna kill me. I was waiting for him to pass. Just go, man. Is it okay? Yeah.
Morning. Morning. Morning, Scott. How's everyone? All right. Morning. Just about awake. How's you going? Uh, mixed success. Some bits were good, some bits weren't. Well, that's, that's fine, because that's what I had during the day. <laughs> um, <clears throat> but I did, um, <clears throat> I sat and watched some of the other streams after we finished up kind of last night. Um, I was sitting watching Foch and uh, UKOG. Um, <laughs> He was nice yeah. enough to stream most of our onboard for us last time. Yeah, um, but it was quite funny that when they were driving, they were like, hold up the Bentley, hold up the Bentley, and he's in a GT4, and I'm sitting watching it going, what? It's like, why are you holding him up? And every corner, he's basically trying to defend. I was yeah. like, oh, this is terrible. I jumped back on Discord and tell me, Kay, and I was like, just leave it. And then I thought, I'll put someone up on the, um, put someone on the thread. But it was just, you know, I thought, just let him by. He's but I think it was because it was um, fourth position. I think, I think it was. Like 38, 39. I thought, yeah, yeah, yeah. They weren't fighting with any GT4s, so they decided to have a fight with um, the GT3 instead. Yeah, yeah. But it does. <laughs> Keep getting themselves busy. But um, yeah, the track, there was loads of crashes last night. Like, loads. Um, I bet. Even the first place guy was off a few times as well, would have been greasy. Yeah, I came um, across um, a Porsche Cup that had a crash, and it involves a couple of D couple of GT threes with him. Uh, can't see that it went well. At least it's, it's not just me that's came off a couple of times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I found a couple of barriers. It's just uh, just one wee lapse of concentration, or trying to get past somebody, or negotiating yeah. GT fours and indicating the them past, and just. Overstepped the mark. I had, a, I had a puncture this morning as well. Oh. First time ever. Wow. We were trying to um, we were trying to run slicks, and the pressure dropped too much and hit a curve and boom. Um, completely gone. Yeah. Um, yeah, completely gone. So what does it mean? Come on, Steve. Uh, what does the pressure drop down to on the tire if it's um, it, the tire tight? It goes. That's it. You just hear like you know, like a flap in the you just ah, hear that and you but... drive, if you drive too fast then it starts on the start of the car and you start to damage it. Gotcha. Right. Never ever heard it. Never never seen it. Yeah. yeah I don't did. let your pressures get too low. Yeah, I did get a notification yesterday every couple of minutes just to say you're losing pressure on the back um rear right. Yeah. And I thought, mm, is that a slow puncture? Uh, obviously we're riding the curves. Yeah, so who's who's going in next? Um so who's on the next? Yeah. Yeah, cool. Um, so, where are we in terms of time wise or laps? <coughs> no, sure. Uh, Constantine is in a minute. I think he's been in for about a lap now, maybe. Uh, this is the second. I had the out lap, this is the second lap now. Yeah, cool. Morning, Constantine. Good morning. And then you're in, Scott, and then I think. Me too, should probably be awake for him. Yeah, maybe um, might be back, and then Steve's into uh, the finish after that, I think. Yes. Um, I don't think we'll be changing. Well, so we'll be changing probably just after the half hour. So I'll end up doing the last thirty minutes by probably or something like that. Yeah, because it will be. Is it one or is it half one? Because it did start slightly later yesterday. Oh, we got. Three, well, literally just under four hours left. Yeah, so say about 20, 20 to 2 UK time. Um, what's uh, the rain situation? Uh, 30 oh. minutes. In 30 Fine minutes. Off. <laughs> yeah, approximately, approximately 30, every 30 to 40 minutes there's okay. some rain. So I turned up at the right time then to go back out the rain? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> all I know is I got a dry stint. That's all I know. That's all I care about. <laughs> That's good. That's a rule of dice. Half of the pressure. The pressure's all right. Yeah, they're at 27 flat now. They're oh, going to probably oh, drop. Cool. Um, but in general, you can see them around floating just under 27. Now they're dropping, yeah. of course. So they're they're actually pretty good now. Temperature is at 17 and 20. Car, oh, um, second place, two seconds behind. Yeah, 
you let him through before turn one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It would have been fine just staying where you were, he would have made his way past you. Yeah, I know, but I mean... Didn't make much of a difference for me. No, it might have done to him. He might have gone for one way and then... Yeah, I was looking at him. I moved before he had a chance to move. He wanted to get the slipstream. What's for breakfast, Steve? Um, bait and walnut bread with some honey on it. So I've probably got about one, two, about 30, 40 minutes. Is that right? Well, so it's, so it's probably going to rain in about two laps time. Cool, make that 15 then, I'll just go nap and grab some meat, alright? Yeah, yeah, come back for then just in case. Yeah, fine for that. So if we do go to rain, uh, should I start setting up the uh, the pit stop? That's what I was going to say. Um, if we think yeah, about what the pressures are going to be, um, mm -hmm. to start. I can at least start working on it. Yeah, do the fuel and then. On the next trade, I'll do the fuel tires. Mm -hmm. Who's driver? Who's next driver? Got it. When you connect. Yes, I also want to join. Um, yeah, 20, we're going with 27.8 um, as the track increased in temp. Oh. Uh, that would be too much in my experience. I'd go 27.3 really to be honest. Okay. Yeah, Previous votes were 27.5 I think, right? Mm, yeah, and that's didn't oh, that I had. They were too hot. I mean, what were we on that uh, uh, thing you were was? using? The truck is 20C now. Alright, okay. You we were using 27.5 overnight to keep using mm. contacts. Sure. So. Right, I'm going to head off for a bit then and get a couple of bits done and have a little sleep. Cool, down. Hot pocket doggy. And see if you guys need me to pick up a stint potentially, but yeah. I'll um, catch you guys in a bit. Yeah. Right. Uh, before we go, how old were you again? Just all good it for a wiggle. Twenty-one and a half. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Eighty-six. So I think I'm thirty-seven. See, that's the thing. When you're twenty-one, 38, 38. if you're twenty-one, you actually do count and a half. At that point, you're still like, oh, yeah, half a year is actually a lot compared to the rest of my day, my my life. <laughs> So you uh, count 30. it. So I'm just basically need to make this up. How old are you, Scotty? No, you did say a while ago, didn't you? Oh no, he's gone. Good back, right? Gone. right, catch you later, guys. Good luck. I'll um, be back in a bit. Thanks. Bye. Okay, more impressive. Yep, we're still chugging along. Three hours and fifty-seven minutes left. Oh, three fifty-one minutes left. But it was going to get a bit of food. He's jumping in next. And the light rain in ten minutes.
I don't think we're going to be getting 33rd because the current 33rd is 7 seconds behind. Yeah, it's going to be a bit hard. This is not, yeah, this is likely to be where we're finished. So, let's just finish. But, you never know. It's no time. the drop. Oh no, it's walnut and date, that's it. Just bit into one and I thought, oh yeah, it's a walnut. A light rain in ten. So uh two um, seconds behind me, right? Uh you two seconds back. Behind you. I would have just kept going there and letting pass on this little. Yeah. Like this, the straight up to that corner. I saw him coming better. too hot, so I kind of spooked it. But anyway. Better safe than sorry. Oh, we could have pulled a Schumacher and just taken him out. Taking P33. Alright, let's do the uh, pit stop stuff. So first off, fuel. Mm -hmm. Um, and driver will be Scott uh, Isles. Yet. No, I mean, just don't do the driver. Oh, but it says his name, so I can't select him. No, you can't select him when he's connected. But it, Scott Isles. Yeah, he's, he's not connected yet. It's in my menu, though. Yeah, he's in there, but he's not connected. Yeah, okay. Um, I'm not going to give him the wheel yet, so... Yeah. You can't, you can't, unless they're connected, you, they're just blank. You can only give it to people actually physically connected to the server at the time. Alright, closing the menu now. And we'll do the tires next round, okay? Mm -hmm. Overshot that one. Got one coming in hot, three seconds. Yep. Once this car gets past, you're good for a while. Behind. So, yeah, you're going to encounter rain on the halfway around this lap. Perfect. That was enough for my joy.
Increase in rain in 30 minutes, has got his gun to get a proper wet session. Make a change. He's right behind you. Yeah, I'll just let him go here. Now it should be pretty smooth. Yeah, you're good for about... Um, um, about 70 seconds. I'll have to know the data I've uploaded overnight. Well, since it started, so I've, I've been streaming to um, YouTube at uh, 7 o'clock this morning. Yeah, I've got it on my uh, Xbox Live Arcade. Oh, yes, that caught me off guard. Yeah, that's what you up. Yeah, no need for coffee. Uh, so, yeah, about 15,000 kbps in AV1 YouTube, uh, and I'm doing the Enhanced Broadcast Beta on Twitch for the last 20 odd hours. So, you're, you're streaming through some service or uh, directly? No, I'm, I'm um, Twitch like, via OBS, and I've also got the RMTP client, which allows you to stream to other services. It basically piggybacks, and it's like a separate connection. Okay. I think on the 4090 you can have eight separate encodes active at the same time. So at the moment I've just got two. Uh, well, two. No, it's actually with the enhanced broadcast beta, you encode five separate streams and send them to Twitch at uh, 1080, 1080 p 60, 720, 60. Oh, you encode uh, everything and send them directly. Oh, rain. Yes, right here. Yeah. Oh, there we go. So yeah, watch your uh, traction control and ABS. Yeah, yeah. Oops, got the areas up that. Reducing rain in 30. I just started my bit of toast there, but I'm actually in the seat sitting watching the list then, so... Um... So what are we going, 27.5? Or... Any pressures? Um, so yeah, stick yeah. wets in. Yep, stick 27.5. 27, yeah. 27.5 all? Yeah. Yep, sorry? Oh. 27.5 all tires? Um, yeah. 27.5 all round, yep. Alright, I'll do it on the it next seems, It seems to be quite even, just depending where you are on a circuit. I'm taking it a bit easy because I don't know where it's going to be too wet or not. I don't want to get caught off guard. The track is greasy already. Curve. Are you in this lap? Are you in one more? Yes, you said. That one. Cool. So it should see through till... Through about 20... No. Yeah, around about half past. Yeah. yeah, actually, yeah, it'd be on the hour, so not real life time. So yeah, so next stint will probably be a, if we get a good one, it'll be about eleven. When you're ready, Scotty. Yep. And 
it's starting to get a, li a little more slippery now. Mm hmm. And just watch the edge of the track. Are we winning? Hey, morning. Morning. Hey, good. Come on, this. Um, 34th at the moment. That's uh, probably, probably going to be where we finished because we've just recently been taken by 33rd. So, buying, you know, things, it's likely to be where we finish. I've been in 34, 34, like, all fucking night. <laughs> <laughs> we did get very shot at 33rd earlier. Good. I'm on bloody in lap, I got caught being, um, Got past by GT three, then further down, like he must have really smacked the wall in bad damage, and he was slow as heck. And I think he, you know what happened to me in the ones ultimate, where that car sort of skewed and went ping, ping, ping on that video. Oh yeah. Uh, same sort of thing. I think he was that badly damaged, and he just went whoop and went across the track and sort of caught me. And but I was on the lap anyway, so. Uh, Right, Scott is in so you can... Oh, yeah. Right, you've got 10 seconds behind. 5 seconds behind. 4, 3, stay there, stay there. Okay. Oh, God. Right. It's getting too wet now. Yep. Yeah, we've got 40 seconds behind, so you're coming in, so... Okay. So we got uh, uh, we got 120 liters. We got wet tires. We got all of them at 27.5. Yep. Uh, Scott Isles is selected. Suspension bodywork. There is no damage. He's not anything. selected. Uh, I can see him on my panel here. He's selected. No, yeah, yeah, no. Yep. Go for yep. cycle. For, no, you've yep. requested me. Now that's, that's requested. it. Okay. Thank you. Good. All right. Um, yep, yeah, we're all Looks set. Looks like it's going to stop in 30, but you know it's. The conditions, just, yeah, it just... It's just getting, uh, it went to damp right now. Again. Yeah. It just went to damp, so it's probably going to increase even more. Mm. Yeah, we've got heavy rain starting now, and it's increasing in 10 minutes. Yeah. The weather's, weather's been brutal. Just I know. I wished it would just stay either wet or dry, just not changing every 30 minutes. Yeah, I think I don't know what they put the ra I think they put the random factor on four. It probably would have been better yeah, on um, two or three. Nice. All right, I pushed the uh, brake balance all the way back. I don't know if it's it's 57 now. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, TCI lifted at five and ABS at four. Should be okay. Fine. Yep. Yep. Yeah. It. it um, if, if we can, if if we have a chance to give them some feedback, that would be it. Because yeah, the, the weather's just shit. Yeah, perfect. It's just completely unrealistic and a real bull lake. All right, thirty just, seconds. Yeah. Thank you. Twenty. Ten. Five, four, three, two, one. Perfect. Thank you. Have a good one. Yeah. Cheers, buddy. Oh, I enjoyed that. Hey, thanks, Jens. That was it. Was a great stint for me. It was a, it was my best stint ever. I. It was my best series of laps ever on the Nordschleife. Not a bit of damage, not even... I don't think I had uh, no, any incidents. Good. So yeah, it was good. A couple, of, a couple of pressure moments with the rain. But yeah, I was saying like the random factor on the rain, because it's like fairly high, like a four. It just gives you like very from one to the other. So that's, that's probably, it's not so much the clouds, clouds are just increasing the possibility of rain. So you could have, um, 
I think the rain was on one, wasn't it? If I remember right, I looking on the website. Maybe even point five on the rain and have the random on two. Yeah, because it's not realistic and it's not fun. Um, yeah. Should probably rain for like four hours and then that's it. Yeah. It did had it, it did have sun for like two minutes, so. <laughs> It literally, it literally the, the sun came out for like two minutes and then it can't, got cloudy. Yeah. It dried up, but the sun was out just for like two minutes. Just yeah, enough, to, came out a, just a enough to be annoying. From, yeah. <laughs> just yeah, enough to be went, annoying. Went, went from uh, wet to dry on my stint, come out, dries. Went with, I can't remember what the pressure was, 26 or something or something. And um, it did time set and even warm up. I think it only ran over like 24 once. <laughs> And then um, it started to rain again, so I had to come in basically so I'd done a stint on ours. Ah, the Essex, the Essex birds are calling. <laughs> yeah. They don't care if it's Sunday morning. Yeah, the, the mating call and a lesser spotted chav. Yeah. Daniel left, le Daniel left his, uh, his mobile in chat in Discord if he's needed for a stint. Oh, okay. No rush. Just so you know. I was uh, going to say, um, yeah, I said, yeah, Brentwood, it's just, like full of lumpers, isn't it? Everyone's orange. Yeah, and it's, it's, it's probably um, the Sugar Heart has just closed or something, so yeah. Uh, As they're spilling out from there and. Oh, careful. Oh, actually, it's 10am. Right. Mm. Oh, yeah, the upper half still um, is in a posh house. And south, south of Brentwood out. It's up the other half is downstairs watching telly. <laughs> yeah, I think I've got about... I went to sleep probably just after one. Oh, oh, yeah. Lid? Whereabouts? What's the area where Chantel is? Where? Oh, oh Horndon on the hill. Uh, or Balkan. Okay. Bolfam. Or somewhere around there. Rings a bell. I mean, I, uh, I've lived here about, I don't know, 15 years or something, mm. so I'm not, I'm not born and bred Essex. Uh, Hi Liam. Ugh. And I would like to move away as well, actually. Scotland ideally. Well, if you've complained about rain in uh, North Life for then, I don't think you'll like Scotland. <laughs> <laughs> It's good if you like gambling. Yeah, the point is, at least the whiskey's better there, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, and if you like walking, I suppose it's, uh, yeah. Yeah, I do like walking and, you know. Uh, yeah. uh, if it's raining, uh, though. All right, Chad. Um, it, was, it was a pretty good... I only did two stints, just two stints. Uh, let's not forget, this is my first 24. I couldn't race at all during Saturday, so yesterday was a complete loss of the day. I couldn't... I wasn't even at home um, and when I was at home I was preparing so I couldn't actually do any runs so I started this morning my first stint the the plan stint was um, one stint and then I do now a double stint the problem is that I am I did not have actually zero confidence in the Bentley uh, Nordschleife I've started getting a hang of it I tried out the Ferrari at the Nordschleife I did 835s uh, with just two laps, so I'm pretty sure I had a lot more time to gain. But with the Bentley, no matter what, I would just maybe go 844. I just did not have the confidence. Maybe it's the setup, maybe it's it's just that I could not drive it. So with that in mind, my first stint came and it was full wet. You can, you, can, you know, uh, go back and uh, watch it. It was terrible. I had off tracks, I hit the wall twice. Um, I had one, min one and a half minute damage on the first stint. But as I said, it was on a track that was full wet in a car that I couldn't trust. 
Um, so it was it was very iffy. And then the second stint, planned stint, uh, was dry. I went out, finally, good run, uh, zero incidents, zero off tracks, maintained position. Of course, we probably not going to go over 34, P34, which we are now, because P33 overtook us. Uh, so we're a lap behind, or I don't know how many laps behind. Um, but it was, it was a good, uh, it was a good stint. I enjoyed it. And, you know, the, the bad thing is with the Nordschleife is like a stint is like, you know, five, six laps, especially if you're kind of slow like I am. Um, but yeah, I will not be racing anymore. Uh, uh, the other three drivers, I think uh, Daniel Crinson will not be doing any more stints. So it's going to be uh, Mr. Git, Steve, uh, Miki, and um, Scotty. Uh, they'll be taking it to the end. And hopefully... I'm wishing them the best. I hope they get the, the finish in P34. For it's for us, it's a win. If there's 79 teams in this specific televised split. This is the televised split, so you got all the big names running in the same split. There's 79 teams. We started P41, and we are P35. So given the fact that you have names like Jardier, uh, Malinowski, um, Niels, Nayox, they're all in this split, and we're P34, I think that's actually a win. Um, so yeah, wishing the best to the rest of the, to the team. Hope they bring it back home. And I don't think I'll be... I'm allowed to stay connected. They have been um, shouting on the uh, uh, on the LFM Discord. If you're not uh, if you're not needed, you disconnect. Which means I will have to also stop the stream. I won't be able to continue. Let me just confirm this. Actually, let me just say goodbye. I'll I'll, I'll close the stream anyway. Getting drip fed, monster. Hey guys, um, can I confirm I won't be doing any more stints, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, go on. You, you, you're fine. Okay. I'm because I'm, I'm have to exit the server as well, but I also exit the house as well, so I'm just mm -hmm. confirming. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah you cool. All right, guys. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, bring it home. This is this yeah. is great. This is great. P34, I think, is a win by all standards, especially in a split like this. So finishing is a win. <laughs> Finishing is a win. Uh, for me, participation in this 24-hour, which was, you know, I just did two stints, but it was a win for me because it was my first. Um, yep. So I really enjoyed it. Thank you guys for this uh, opportunity. And, um, yeah, we'll talk. All right? Yep. Well, catch up. Cheers, buddy. Thanks, guys. Yeah. See you later. All right. And to the chat, this was my first ever super early in the morning. I got five. I got up. 5.30 a.m. Got in the car around 6.30 a.m. Drove to 7.30 and then got back in around 11. Uh, so this was... Yeah, it's it's a weird time for me to be in a rig. Usually at this time of day, we're probably somewhere outside, which we'll probably be doing anyway now. Um, we won't be sticking too much around the house, I guess. We live in Greece. The weather outside is actually pretty good. Um... But, uh, yeah, thank you for sticking around. I would like to switch over to my amazing supporters and say once again a huge thank you. Um, let me actually get out of the server. Because they're going to start shouting. So get rid of the PIP. We don't need that. Um, yeah, and let me pull up. All my gold supporters, because I really want to thank them as well. So first off, we got Anthony Hall, Augustine Martin, John Hart, Cody Flowers, Corey Wise, Dan Westerman, Daniel Newman, David Beam, Eric Castillo Bachero, Brian Sparagos, Graham Baptist Wright, Jeff King, Iñaki Duranona, Jason Rivera, Jared Davis, Stefan Malfier, Chris Rollins, Marianne Christel, Mark Long, Michael Pagliaro, Paddy Falconer, Brad Jackson, Robert Robles, Rita Ruhlman, Sean Reed, Simon Tunin, Tiago Silva, Tobias Hoff, William Martin, Josh Fulton, Mark Worthington, and Mark Gale. Thank you for going over and beyond and becoming gold supporters. And thank you to every other supporter that has been following and supporting the project. Um, I don't know if you noticed, between two stints, I literally made an update to the dash. And now the predicted lap actually works pretty good. It's I don't know if it's... I need to test it a bit more, but it may be... The solution that we were all really looking for and you've been telling me this but it didn't make sense 
So I'll be testing it a bit more and see if it works on other sessions, um, you know, AI sessions, the ones that I do basically to test the dashboard. So we might be solving that, but the gaps, I'm also, so what I want to do now is I want to fix these things. I want to fix the predicted lap time and the gaps for track and class opponents. And then I need to, guys, I actually need to stop working on anything else and get to the pit wall. I know you guys have been absolutely correct on telling me and calling me out on that for the pit wall. But the dashboard has been a preoccupation. It has been one of the biggest, highly used products that I have. And I couldn't leave it with a bug and I couldn't leave it without new features, especially these, you know, class features and stuff like that. But the same exact things that I'm putting in the dashboard will be used in the pit wall. So these things, although the pit wall is completely different code base, it's got a completely different widgets. It's it's different in all aspects and respects. Um, the changes that I'm making to the dashboard will bleed into the pit wall. So it's it's like it's a common thing uh, uh, at the end of the day. Like I'm building for one, but also building for the other. It's just that the pit wall needs extra work to put everything in there. Um, but anyway, and Philip, I'm proud that you are a supporter. And Inyaki, again, you too. Jens, everyone that's been, Bruno, everyone that's been in the stream today, today anyone who woke up or is up because you live in a different time zone, thank you for joining me. I will see you guys on Tuesday. So Tuesday we'll be doing LFM, Wednesday Chill Chat and Dev, and Thursday LFM. I haven't seen the schedule. Do we have LFM this week or is it still off season? Does it start now? If it doesn't start, then I don't know what we'll do. We'll just probably do chill chat and devs. When is the... Um, um, where's the schedule? I had the schedule. Oh, let me go to the Patreon. Let me just check the schedule. Does it start now? You guys know? Oh, okay, good. I'm not even looking at it. Capitan, welcome to the stream. Um, yes, okay. So if it starts next week, I will be doing LFM. And hopefully I'll be doing good on LFM. And I have new hardware to show. That camera over there, that one over there, that's that beautiful camera. You can see it's changing as well. It's going from light to dark. That is the brand new Elgato Facecam MK2. It's got a much wider, I don't know if you've seen it. It's much wider and it's super clear. And I also added, just so you know, but it's not gonna stay there for long. I added that pedal cam. The only reason I didn't use it today for the race, the pedal cam, is because there actually is no light. The light that you see now is coming from the window, and I don't, I don't stream during the daytime. It always is nighttime, so I need to find a light and put it there. Where well, you can see my pedals, my shoes. I'll see if I keep it there. We'll see. Maybe I'll change position. Um, but the idea is that I will have at some point a pedal cam. But I'm really happy with this one over here. It's really nice. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for being here. And I will see you on Tuesday. Have a great Sunday wherever you are in the world. Bye.